You look cool, baby. Walking the dogs. It is hot out. Did she? Um, but we want to get them nice and tired because me and Joey are gonna go kind of have a day together and go on a hike. So we're taking them on a nice long walk. They're already so tired, they're walking so slow. Um, and then me and Joey are gonna go check this place out, go on a hike, and I think we're gonna get a fall coffee. And then we're gonna have some dinner, we're gonna have salad. With Joey freaking battered so much chicken and fish, and it tastes yeah, so good. Really good. What'd you use to batter it? Um, almond flour, right? Almond flour. Almond flour Get and over. Um, and some panko, uh -huh. and then some seasoning. I used some dried basil, some garlic powder, some honey hype. Honey hype. Yeah. I was like, why is this but, so good? He's like, I used honey hype. Yeah. I'll leave that link down below for anyone who wants. It. The best seasoning ever. Yeah, it was so yummy, Joey. Did a good job. Joey used to work at PDQ and he would batter the chicken and it reminded me of that watching yeah. him do it. Yeah. <laughs> I worked at PDQ like, I don't know, about almost 10 years ago. Yeah, a long time ago. So Brooke is gonna bark at this motorcycle. Watch. Brooks hates bikes and motorcycles. Let's see if he does it. No, no, no. It's nice bike. rammed into me. Uh, he wants to chase it. Yeah, he wants to chase it. He's like, that's not normal. Apparently it's pretty instinctual from dogs that, I've yeah. seen a lot of videos of dogs that chase motorcycles and then when they stop, they, um, <laughs> the dog just doesn't know what to do. It just sits there and like kind of barks at the motorcycle. When Brooks was a lot younger and we were still like training him and stuff, we took them to the dog beach and a lady was jogging on the dog beach <laughs> Remember? Yeah. And Brooke started running after her, like, yeah. playfully. Yeah, just like running alongside her. It was just her. so funny, and it was like the instinct when they see someone running, you know? We're gonna head home, drop them off, <laughs> and then we're gonna go out to this new place, and we'll show you guys some clips and stuff. We might see some alligators. Yeah. And then we're gonna get a coffee and go home and There's um, usually make a lot dinner. of alligators at uh, this place. Yeah, that's what it says. We've never been. I've been there once. Oh, you have? Yeah, when I was a kid. Oh, you remember there was alligators? There was a ton. Oh gosh. Like, that's why we're not bringing the dogs. I'm terrified probably, of the, when dogs I went there, and there alligators. There was probably about 400 alligators sitting what on the, the heck? sitting on the side of the river. Oh hell. And no. like just kind of like sunbathing, I guess. Oh my gosh. And yeah, it, it was pretty crazy. Yeah, you can bring dogs, but I don't know. I just want to check it out first so because... That's, that's where we were canoeing. That I'm wasn't scared. like in the park area. It was like down the river you can canoe uh -oh. from. Uh, there's still a lot of alligators. Tired. Tired. Walk in the grass. Aren't your paws hot? That's why we like coming over here because they can walk in the grass, but they never do. <laughs> I, I would assume if it hurt their paws. Yeah, if it hurt their walk. paws, I feel like they would walk in the grass. Last night we cleaned our shed, gym, so it's nice and clear. We keep all our storage in here and our laundry and our workout stuff. So I got my treadmill, got some like beach stuff, tools, storage, laundry, and then weights. This is all like exercise stuff as well. All my bands and things like that. So, no excuse to not work out. All right, we asked you guys on Instagram to let us know about the fall drinks and what to get. I got the apple crisp macchiato iced with almond milk and it has like a brown sugar syrup I think and like an apple flavor it's pretty good it's not great it 
It needs like a foam, like a creaminess to yeah, it. Yeah, for the top. Yeah. Yeah, that, it would make it really good if it did. But mine is amazing. It's <laughs> um, it's a little sweet, but it's really good. It's um, just a cold brew iced coffee with the uh, pumpkin foam. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. It's a venti iced coffee with a splash of cream and the pumpkin um, cold, cold foam. brew foam or cold yeah, foam. Cold foam, yeah. It's you really can tell we good. don't go to Starbucks a lot. Yeah, but it's got like a cinnamon sprinkle on top. So and, thick. And a you know, foam layer. It's really good. So good. So that's our fall Starbucks order. That's our pre workout. <laughs> yeah, hopefully we can burn this off, all the sugar. We're going to go hike. Hopefully, burn the calories that this is probably yeah, has. About, I don't know how many it's calories. A, it's about 105 degrees outside, it's so, so I, hot. I think we'll burn it off. So. <laughs> it's crazy, that's like natural stuff. It's so cute. You think we can find a spot down there? I see some open. You want to go down there? Hope you bust your butt. Cute. Go. Ooh, kind of up high. What are you trying to do? <laughs> oh shit. We are in a swamp. Wait, I think it we is. burned off the Starbucks. I think so. It's uh, it's muggy. Do you think we could take the dogs here? That we should? Yeah, next time. Yeah. We saw sure. a few dogs. Yeah. We'll take them next time. Yeah. I haven't seen any alligators, but we haven't gone to where the alligators are. Um, we've seen a few dogs. So we'll take them next time. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit different than what I thought it was going to be, which is a good thing. Yeah, it's pretty. Are we going straight? Uh, yes. Okay. Tired? Water break? Yeah, we sweat a lot. Yeah. Drinking some water. Taking a break. All right, we just got back. I'm gonna make a little drink with coconut water and this sparkling frost drink. I'm gonna mix the two because I usually don't like this sparkling frost drink by itself. So I have a little bit of ice in here. I'm gonna add like half coconut, like right there and then half of the lemon frost for a nice refreshing drink after that long hike. And now I'm gonna go shower because I look, I look crazy. It's very hot. Mm. So good. Here is all the chicken Jay made that we mentioned he made with his batter and everything. There's a lot of chicken. <laughs> like there's so much. And we air fried it so it's a lot healthier to air fry if you're gonna use like panko and breadcrumbs um, or flour. It's a lot healthier to air fry it rather than do it in oil because it's actually pretty decent in calories just having a little bit of breadcrumb on the chicken breast. And it tastes really good, so we really prefer to have our chicken like this. We're more inclined to eat it. Um, so yeah, we're gonna have a nice big salad for dinner. We are so hungry after that hike. Oh my gosh, so excited to, oh my gosh, dig into this. That the one air conditioner is not even on. I got a package from Amazon. I'm just gonna 
open it up. Oh, I don't think this is the makeup. <laughs> we have, um, this is what we've been giving the dogs. These are probiotics. Um, they've already went through one whole container and a half a container and I just ordered another one because I've noticed a huge difference in their skin. That's why we wanted to give it to them. They both have like skin irritation and um, we actually learned that dogs need probiotics and that helps with skin. So we got the Petal, Petal B Co. And we've really been liking it and the dogs love it. And then I got this book. This is called The Courage to be Disliked. So I got this book. I saw Lonnie Jane mention this and I literally buy any book recommendations that she gives because everyone is always really great and really transformative. It's by, I don't know how to pronounce their name, but I'll leave it linked down below for anyone interested. Um, so I'm really excited about that. And then my makeup didn't come yet, so that's a bummer. Um, I got like some blush and eyeshadow, some like lip liner, lip gloss. Maybe I'll show that when it comes in another vlog, but I'm gonna give the dogs their probiotics. Trixie, you want your probiotic? Did you already finish that? One for you. One for you, Missy. Okay, that's all. You get two a day, Mr. and Mrs. Me and Joey are trying to pick out a movie to watch. We are exhausted. We both have freaking blisters on our feet. Joey has blisters. I have blisters. How are you feeling? Feeling all right. Feeling good. Yeah. Just, uh, yeah, I got blisters on my feet, but. It was a little bit so. longer of a hike, I feel like, than we than we thought it was gonna be. <laughs> yeah, but it was fun. It was like really relaxing and peaceful out there. And mm -hmm. We got a good workout in. And Definitely. And I feel like we wanna do this more often. We were talking about that a lot yeah. on the walk that we want to go out there more and walk and be outside and like, we were talking about like envisioning like our best selves and what that looked like and for me that's definitely like working out more and being active outside so yeah. we had a lot of perspective so that will be our goal moving forward mm -hmm. isn't that right Bubba? oh my gosh he does he want look look he just wants to climb on top he just want to climb on top he just wants some love and mom yeah. Oh. oh! Oh, you are big old babies. We are making our salads. I have mine right here. I have balsamic and olive oil dressing with some spinach artichoke, chicken, onions, tomatoes, lettuce. I even did dried basil, salt and pepper. And then Joey's making a chicken, a blue cheese salad, because he loves blue cheese yes i do so it's gonna be good I'm what's using, all in uh, yours the marie's uh light mm -hmm. blue cheese it's uh pretty healthy yeah and you Stephanie. don't use that you don't need yeah. that much because it's so yeah potent. i don't like it i don't like it real dressing mm -hmm. but i like dressing. the crumbles in it but mm -hmm. 70 calories for two tablespoons i probably use like three tablespoons mm -hmm. um but yeah, just the chicken, the blue cheese, uh, bacon crumbles, and um, I'll put a few croutons in it as well. These are the bacon crumbles we love. They're so much better than bacon bits. They're like actual real, real bacon. Yeah, real you bacon. can have one tablespoon for 30 calories, which is actually pretty good. And then this is the croutons he uses. I opt out for croutons because I just, I don't know. I don't always love them, especially in this type of salad. Yeah. So, yours looks super yummy. We have so many calories left over, we've hardly ate today. Yeah. So we're loading it up. 